So CJ So Cool just put out a video on his channel and it is titled, Finally Moving Into My New Home, Kamari and Nike Loved It. And at the beginning of the video, he did say a few things that I definitely want to talk about with y'all. He's starting to sound like he actually is maturing and he's not about the whole flashy, showing everything he has. Shoes, clothes, jewelry. I think he's changing. That's just something that I'm trying to get into now. I don't want to always blast everything in y'all face like, oh, I'm flexing, I'm flexing. So this condo that I'm going to show y'all later on today, mind you, it's a one bedroom. So CJ was talking about how the place that he got is much smaller than what he has now. It's a one bedroom place. He does say it's still luxurious, but it is a one bedroom, but he will hopefully upgrade to a three bedroom in time. But he brought up another channel, PewDiePie, which I'm pretty sure a lot of people know. And he says, that person, he doesn't flex and show everybody what he has. He said PewDiePie obviously makes a lot more money than he does, has a lot more subscribers than he does, but you don't see him on here trying to show everybody his home, his cars, his jewelry, and stuff like that. So it looks like CJ wants to take advice from this guy and maybe change how he approaches the internet because he doesn't want to portray that this is a lifestyle that everybody needs to have and follow. Now, of course, CJ is still going to be buying all of the shoes, all the jewelry, the clothes. He's still going to be doing all of that, but he doesn't want to broadcast it online like he's been doing in the past because he says that it's not necessary. He doesn't need to do that, and he doesn't want people that watch him to think that that's the right way to go about it. Every time you buy something, you have to show it online. Now, I'm pretty sure a lot of people love seeing everything that CJ buys all the time. I'm sure people love the whole box opening time on his videos. So I really want y'all to let me know, what do you think? Do you think he should continue to do what he's been doing and showing everybody all of the stuff that he buys all the time? Or do you agree with him and think, maybe you shouldn't do that. Find something else as content. Now, in my opinion, I don't know if CJ will stick to this mindset that he has now. But if he does, it does seem like he's maturing a little bit and thinking that maybe the things aren't as important as the people in his life, his kids, any future relationship, maybe he's starting to realize that people are way more important than buying them things. Now, I know a lot of people probably missed it, but CJ said that if the family decides to come back, he'll just go ahead and get another mansion. Right now, he is downsizing to a one-bedroom place, but if they decide to come back, he'll just get another mansion. Do y'all think they're coming back? It's not only gonna help me mentally, but it's gonna help me financially, and then you know, if, if the family decides to come back, then I know what to do. I just go get another mansion. It's easy. But right now, it's just me. So I need to just live like it's just me. So yes, Royalty did have a video on her channel now. And she said getting furniture, moving to her new place. She said she already has a new place. Things like that. But honestly, I'm not going to believe it until I see it. Because y'all know what happened last time. She said she had a place. She went furniture shopping. She was waiting to move in. And then all of a sudden, she's back with CJ. And they move in a place together. Is all of this just a foreshadowing for the future? For them to come back together and just do exactly what they did last time? Do y'all think it's really over? I just don't think it is. I think royalty's gonna go back. I really do. But let me know your opinion on that in the comments. So another reason why CJ kinda didn't wanna show us this new place that he's in is because he didn't want people to make fun of him or talk about him for having a one bread room. I think he said it's a condo. So of course he promotes this flashy lifestyle. So now that he's downsizing, he thinks people will talk bad about him. But honestly, I don't think there's anything to talk bad about him with on this situation because it's great. Now, I never really heard him talk about saving money before, but if you have, let me know. But this is actually the first time I've heard him say that if he downsizes, get a place that's below his means, he can actually save money. Usually he's just spending, 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 spending every single day. But now he's actually thinking about saving and if he has to get a bigger house in the future. I think that's great. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. Like I said, it's gonna be quick because it's small. Don't freaking roast me, all right? I'm trying to be a normal individual. I'm trying to humble myself. This is what d -Lo said. d -Lo said this will humble me, so hopefully he's right. Now, I also wanted to say that d -Lo seems like a really good influence on CJ. Ever since he's came around, I think CJ has been doing things differently gradually, but he has been doing things a little bit different. I think d -Lo is a sensible person. And he's somebody that CJ probably needed in his life a long time ago. So I think the condo is really nice. I think the furniture goes well with everything. I like how he decorated. The bedroom is really nice. Everything looks really good. I like the way he did it. And of course he has a whole bunch of shoes stacked up everywhere. But that's him. What are you going to do? So CJ also wanted to point out that he is a very clean person. 
Everything he has is always neat, organized, and his closets are always neat. The shoes are obviously very neat in boxes. But he got really tired of the kids and royalty not keeping the house clean. He expected it to be clean the way it was when he left the home and when he went back. But he has kids, so. But I'm very, very, very clean. Did you guys know? That was one of my only issues with my, with my family is that I'm so clean and neat. And I just always wanted to be the same way when I come back. I just wanted to look clean no matter what, no matter who was there. Everything should always be the exact same way as it was when I left. But hey, now he has his own place and he'll be able to keep it as clean as he wants it to be. And hey, it worked out. Seems like it, right? But let me know all of your thoughts and opinions on this video down below. Do you think CJ is actually changing for the better? Do you think CJ and Royalty are going to get back together like I think? Let me know what you think in the comment section down below.